and hello everybody welcome to an exciting pickup video which is going to be very exciting as you can see it is a box with nothing on it and the other on the other side we have a sticker that is always awesome but we are going to unpack this um, actually I saw this uh, very recently and I was kind of curious in getting it and of course I'm a sucker for these collector's editions no, no, not really since a few months ago I guess see when, when I got the Sonic Generations and then the Injustice for All collector's edition or the Blimps edition or special edition something something edition and now we're gonna open this game which nobody has to Still has to see what this is going to be. But nobody has a clue, except for I do. I know. I what it, I know what it is, but I'm not. I'm not telling. That will ruin the surprise. And this gives me a reason to put some Zelda, Legend of Zelda sound effects when I'm done with unpacking this thing. Give me a good excuse. Right. Let me just open this up. If it will go up our rate, that would be kind of. Handy and dandy, don't want to do it too extreme, don't want to cut myself open during the, all of this. So let me just open this up. This is not going very well according to plan. There we go, that's one bit. And that's the second bit complete. Yes, it's the right version this time. Um, yeah, it's kind of a fun story to connect to it. But first, we're gonna open this up. Get ready for the. You can see. You can see it yet. Mahaha! <laughs> Even like that. I'm just putting like that. Okay. Here it goes. It's Tomb Raider, Tomb Raider, Tomb Raider stuff. The collector's edition. Yes, I actually got this. Well, that was actually quite interesting, looking at the Tomb Raider things and stuff. I was looking, okay, probably should look at like this so everybody could see what's in there. It's a Survivor's Born, actually, um, well, I used to play a little bit of the original Tomb Raider, Tomb Raider and I never really got into it back in my day, but um, this caught my eye and I was really curious and the reviews were really good for this. So I thought, hey, might as well give it a go. I'm very curious about this. So, how about we... It's the winner of 44E3 awards. With the IGS Game of, the Game of Show 2012. The... What does it say? Best Show. The Best of E3 2012 winner. And the something, something winner. So that means we got a winner on our hands. So, let me just... Pop this right here, and then just open this classic thing up so we can look, we can look on the inside. Because nobody cares about the outside. Yeah, so, nobody cares about the outside. Yeah, I, I mentioned earlier the right version this time. Actually, I did order it like uh, a week ago on Wednesday, week ago, Wednesday week ago, and I. I uh, just ordered it, nothing really special to it. I'm like, oh, okay, I'm gonna re maybe get it for like Monday or Tuesday. And when it actually when it actually arrived, I got myself the Xbox 360 version. And I was like, wait, this isn't right. Must have been a mistake on their end because I'm always blaming them. Must be a mistake on their end. So I just okay, I'm just take a look at the order which I got. And it depends. I actually did order the Xbox 360 version. My god, you're an idiot. <laughs> That's what I thought. <laughs> Gee, man. Okay, how about we uh, zoom in a little bit? Or, well, we can't really put the forward charging right now. The survival kit. That's better. Like I see, a bit better. Let me just open this up for you. And for me, because I'm also curious what is in here. Uh, just a sheet of paper with a picture on it of the. I think it's the ship which they sailed in and that um, broke or something. Yeah, the ship broke. Oh god, the ship broke down. And the scenes over here, we have ourselves 
Laura Croft herself. I'm gonna just remove this and we'll take a look at her. And there's a bow and arrow. Look, get. Hold on. Sorry, Laura. Get, get rid of this first. Come on, open up. Since we have ourselves Miss Croft over here. Very nice in details. Take a look at the. And with a bunch of. Like, you can't really move this, can you? Let's. This, oh god, it's a bit frosty and I something fell. Oh wait, it's the Ooh, guns and hands. What? Oh uh, yeah, okay. Yeah, okay. So we're gonna see move these, I guess. Shoes. Um like this is like about a million points where I can move it. Okay, the legs are a bit stiff, yours the legs are a bit stiff, Miss Croft. Can move these hands, I guess. Hey, how's it going? Hi, Miss okay, that's pretty bad voice, huh? Let's not let's not do that. What's up? Let's go on. Like this. Let's go on. I'm Lara Croft and I'm awesome and stuff. So yeah, that's a very good looking figure actually. So you could put here the, the bow and arrow. I have to set the I have to still set the thing up so that it's, you know, complete. So I'll uh, probably when I, in the next pick of video I'll probably show it off. So look a bit of a Sideways, side, not really sideways. Okay, let me just take a look. So yeah, a Laura Croft right here. I'm gonna have to string her out of it. Put his hands down. Put your hands down, Laura. Put your hands up. So yeah, it's a very nice figurine right here. And I have to set this thing, set the things up because it came with this actually, a couple of hands and the gun some sort of thing and the shotgun I got a shotgun also with the bow and arrow you see right here just a bow there's an arrow and also says how to probably how to install it yes because it's totally a computer program so this should be interesting so I have to take a look at it how to um, properly put things together so that's probably also interesting let's just so you can actually see it, I guess. Oh, just actually you can see it. Um, can you, can we make you sit down? Can we make you sit down? Ow! Ow! ow, ow. Okay, that's a work. Sorry. Can we just go here? I guess. So it should be it should be still be visible. Yeah, good enough. And here's the shotguns and stuff. Right, let's see, the next bit is the actual game itself, which has still like a few things in it, which I will um, open up right now for you. Does it look like the rest is just an empty case, nothing really special to it, so you can actually use it probably for something, for something different. You probably can use this for maybe games or something. Very, very interesting indeed. Let me just clang, let me just open this up for you. Also got something else with it, which was the right thing that came with the wrong order, <laughs> because I ordered two things one that day. It's the game and something else, so I will show you in a second. Let me just open this up for you. I'm not very okay. Just sit over here and just put the plastic over there. Not with the bow and arrow. I'm gonna leave it over here because that's rather important. Let's see, do you open like oh, let me just zoom out for a bit so you can actually see it bit better. Open this up. We got ourselves a little, uh, what's that, waterproof thing? Let's take a look. Um, the, let's see, it's the the full Tomb Raider, Tomb Raider game. Well, it better be the full game. <laughs> a double-sided map of the island and a poster. The Art of Tomb Raider uh, book. Uh, 10 downloadable tracks of the original soundtrack and the Hitman Absolution weapon pack and a, pro a protecting survival bag. Ooh, interesting. Why the Hitman Absolution weapon pack? Um, well, maybe it's also made by Square Enix. That makes sense. So yeah, this is the waterproof survival pack. Interesting. No, I'm not sure what I'm going to use it for, but I'll think of something. So I'm gonna leave it for here. Just leave it still in the package. Let's see, this is the oh god! 
stitched. Okay, let me just sit over here. It's maybe a bit better. So quickly, the art book, still fresh of the freshness. Actually, very nice over here. Let's see all of the um, text came along with it. Maybe I'll just quickly show you the artwork. Looks like these ships that they are cruising on. I know a bit of the story, but not much. Got Lars like 21 years old, and then they were on a ship on an expedition, and then the ship crashed on an island, and Laura survived. She has to make a woman out of herself. No, not to make a man out of her. So it doesn't make any sense in this kind of regard. A very, very nice art book, if I say so myself. Just gonna quickly go through the pictures. Very quickly. Let's see what's over here. Looks like a temple sort of or artifacts or parachuting hang gliding, yay, fun stuff in our craft. Let's take a deeper look into this. If anyone is curious, I might do a small side series of this game on my channel. Like a blind run of this, like a one or two like maybe on Sunday, Sunday is Tomb Raider Day. We'll have to, maybe, this sounds interesting because I don't want to wait too long with this and if I'm going to play Blight I'd rather do it now than wait like a few months before I do this. So yeah, if anyone's interested in the Tomb Raider Sunday blindness run idea, post in the comment section and I'll take a look at it. Very great detail over there. Very, very nice artwork. A bunch of guns and a... Something like a walkie talkie or something. Something walkie talkie. Yes. And some of the other characters in the game. Which I don't know the names of. Yet. But, uh, well, I actually do know what has something to do with I what I have in a moment. You know, the tough guys in here. It's all, all from the same college and stuff. Yeah, okay, and what's this? What is happening? Like a weird pattern. Yar! Okay, <laughs> well, it look, looks like it. I mean, you can tell the endurance, that was the ship called. And here's also a bunch of guys and art and stuff. So, overall, a very nice little art book. Say something? No, it wasn't. It's just a very nice little art book to uh, Miss Laura Croft is getting. All the things on it, because she likes that. And here is the, oh god, it's bigger than I thought. <laughs> the poster. Let me just put it a bit backwards. Let me see a bit better. The poster. Very nice. I might put it on my wall. And the other side is the map. Let me just, other side. Let me just take a look. The map of the islands. The mountain village. She has a shrine. Shipwreck Beach, Cliffside Bunker, the Himiko's Castle, the Great Falls, um, Monastery Gate, Yama Yamatai, Yam Yamatai, Yamatai Island. It's probably proper pronunciation in the game. <laughs> and the WW2 Communications Bunker. Very interesting. That poster is very. That's a, that's a keeper right there. So yeah, that is the poster right here. Just put this over here. Don't need to see this because it's, it has uh, the code on it for the soundtrack. The original soundtrack. Just a bit of picture. Not showing the code because I'm awesome like that. But you can. And last but not least, the game itself. Tomb Raider for 18 years over. Survival Survivor is born. The winner of 44 E3 awards. And the IGN game show 2012. And with two teams, we can also survive as a team. Play with different multiplayer modes. Lara's passengers of the Yamata scavengers. Well, it just doesn't hurt to open this up either. It's still busy anyway. Just 14 minutes in. Might as well open this up. Let's take a look. Of the it's not pretty. Okay, now it's open. The game itself and the manual. That's it. Okay, let me just put this down for a second. And let me just get rid of this. What is it, this man? Oh, that's the Hitman Absolution thing, I guess. It's just, uh. Yeah, that's the Hitman Absolution weapon pack. Get it. Oh god. 
so you can get, get a few weapons of the Hitman Absolution um, weapons pack. So interesting. This is the Square Enix members car. Oh yeah, okay, yeah. Yeah, Hitman Absolution is also made by Square Enix. That makes sense. That's what the weapons are about. Alright. It seems we... Just a small thing of um, member seeking stuff. And the also awesome manuals that they have right now. Ooh. Official Tomb Raider store. You can find it here at merch.tombraider.com. Uh, clothes, art, collector's items, exclusivities, and even more! Take a look right now. Right now. Mm, right now. Treehouse brand stores. Awesome. Yeah, the manual is not really anything new. It's just the, the notes, which nobody ever uses, ever. Uh, just guarantees say you need any help. Speaking of help, and the controls stuff. It's always fun. So let me just put this on the side. We have gone through this. Just this the game. Just press it. Here is the survival kit. Loud. Just put it over here. The survival kits. The game itself. Um, probably should put this all in one piece so I won't get confused where things are. So the. Yeah, there we go. The survival kit, the bow and arrow and guns and stuff. Miss Croft. Just put it over here. And the DLC. Or no, it's a soundtrack. It's a soundtrack right here. I have to also put this in here. In case I forget. And it all fits nicely in one slot. So, let me just put this over here. Just close up, please. I have more to show. Professionalist, da 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 da. <laughs> and this, and just a few plastic things, and yeah, the, the cover of the survival kit. Okay, I have only one more thing to show you. This is the thing that came with the, um, which I ordered with the Xbox version accidentally. <laughs> Xbox version accidentally. And I got this because I was also just a bit curious on how those things work. And I was I don't know, maybe, I might as well get this one, not, 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 nothing too much. It's the Tomb Raider Limited Edition Strategy Guide. I so actually never had a strategy guide before, I was actually really curious about this one. This is the same picture as the... It's the same picture, yum, they're boring. <laughs> Let's take a quick peek inside. I think it's really... I've just peeked a little bit through here, nothing special this. Something with all the, the multiplayer and the... The single player where everything is, and the characters, and the uh, um, trophies and achievements. I just have to take a quick look through here. There's the enemies right over here, so very nice. Enemies, and the heroes of the story with all the guns and stuff. And the ranks and all the fun stuff. So I've just had a, a bit of a look through it to connect the oh god, I just. So you can actually see what the hell is in here. These survival guys, survival gear, survivors, enemies, the entire story, collectibles, and survival multiplayer, and the trophies and extras. So yeah, this is what I got with it. Uh, if I get stuck somehow or somewhere, I'm gonna use this. But the blind thing is still open. Just saying. So again, if anyone's interested in the blind run of this game for like a Sunday or something, put it in the comment section. And it also came with a little um, amulet or a necklace that Laura also wears in the game. It'd be quite nice. I don't know how I'm going to use it for who or what. Because I'll think of something, maybe i give it to my next girlfriend saying, you are my, you can be my Tomb Raider any day. And if she gets it, then it's an instant win, I guess. <laughs> yeah. I get many girls. I'm so lonely. Yeah. Okay. Just quick recap what we have. We have the lower action figure. Action, action figure. We have the Tomb Raider uh, Collector's Edition. We got the box that came with it. The sheet of paper. The um, strategy guide. And the necklace that came with the game. Uh, the the guide. 
So yeah, that's going to be it for now. If you are interested in seeing the Lara Croft Blindness of Stuff, the Tomb Raider Blind series, on a Sunday or something, uh, post in the comment section, uh, share it and like with your friends, and click the subscribe button for more awesome videos like this. Yeah, I'm getting more into the advertising stuff and the marketing, but this for another time. So that's going to be it. Thank you for watching. Make sure to love you. It's super sonic signing off. See you then and see you at the next part or maybe even at uh, Tomb Raider Blind. So I'll see you there. Bye bye.